Many in the cultural and tourism sectors were caught off guard yesterday when a lawmaker claimed that the National Palace Museum planned to close its Taipei branch for a three-year renovation project. After dodging reporters all day yesterday, the museum's director came forth today to address the lawmaker's report. Director Chen Qinan said it's true that shutting down the Taipei branch was one option on the table. But he said that at the moment, the museum was leaning towards renovating the Taipei building without closing the entire facility. A lawmaker said yesterday that the National Palace Museum planned to close its Taipei branch for a three-year renovation project. News of the closure shocked Taiwan's culture and tourism sectors. But today, the director of the museum said it probably won't come to pass. According to the original plan for the new National Palace Museum, there is no mention of closing the museum. We are leaning toward not closing the museum while carrying out the expansion and renovation. In 2025, the National Palace Museum will mark its 100th anniversary. Museum officials say they want to build a so-called new National Palace Museum, and moving the Taipei collection down south is only one of the options. The National Palace Museum should be in Taipei. After all, it's a Taipei National Palace Museum. Jiayi is really quite remote. I don't think I would visit the Jiayi branch. It's not very convenient. Rumors have swirled that closing down the Taipei branch was a bid to drive visitors to the museum's branch in Jiayi, or even to boost DPP's support in the county's elections. Lawmakers get information from all sorts of channels, but they do not see the big picture of our thinking and planning. They just cherry-pick pieces of information and use it during interpolation. Chen made a point to say that multiple proposals were being considered, and that at the moment, the museum was leaning toward not closing down the Taipei branch during its renovation.